I teach a number of different conversations in my classroom that really, you know, are under the umbrella of difficult dialogues. Now, one of the things that I really want to make clear is I don't just talk about these once in my class, but it is integrated throughout every single class. One of the topics that I talk about is homelessness. We look at homelessness from a local standpoint, what is going on in our community, as well as what is going on on campus. How are students impacted by homelessness? I also talk about race. I think it's very important to address anti-racism, anti-blackness in the classroom and you know other categories of, of individuals that are often left out. Race is something that you know I've really focused on, especially this year. Another topic that I, I focus on is grief and loss. It's very, very challenging to talk about people who, have you, who you have lost in your life um, or who you are observing right now that are basically dying. But it's important to talk about because one of the things that we all have in common is one, life, and second, death. We are all going to die at some point. So why not de develop a culture where we can talk about this as something that's normal instead of something that is ostracized or you know excluded. Another topic that I talk about in my classroom is the experiences of LGBTQ plus. And I think that's important be because you know when we look at gender, it's not just two things. It's more than that. And we need to be able to talk about, you know, how are other people, basically identifying themselves and why and be able to celebrate those differences. And so I kind of talk about some of these conversations in my class as the dark side of interpersonal communication. And when I do introduce it, my students love it because the dark side looks at both the light and the dark. It looks at what we kind of hide, what we decide not to talk about in interpersonal relationships but that these, the dark and light, are both very important to talk about. And so in terms of why do I talk about, you know, difficult dialogues in my classroom, I think it's essential for teaching, learning, and for building a community where everyone can empathize with one another and be collaborative so that we can, you know, work as a team instead of having this us and them mentality. We have to be done with that. We have to shut the door to us and them. And let's talk about the things that matter in our everyday lives.